emergency controller. It's a two-axis controller. I'm going to go over the manual mode buttons. Or to activate the um, buttons, you go ahead and push the Y. And you'll see the red light up there. Um, and go ahead and do the, the slow buttons first. And these are your bottom ones or your fast for your Y positioning, which is for your Y depth. Um, your X is for your flange length. Your slow buttons, then you got your fast. Swing back here. And you got your cancel key, your programming key, your um, semi automatic, your automatic um, continuous mode, um, your parameters key, your stop key, your um, go, go, your um, duplicating key, your enter key, your um, back edge retract. Uh, which also works with your delay timer as you can see over here um, For instance if you have a part in there and you don't want to kick back towards you It allows you to take that time to get the part moved before the back gauge comes forward on you Yes, you can toggle your retract off and on. Yep. You got your um, Work hours push it again to get back out of it your um, total count your of your strokes Push it again to get back out of that button also and you got uh, next key for next step, you got your back gauge, which it just kind of works as your slow, same buttons up here. But you just, they're always activated. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, bend this part. Well, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to uh, program the part, and then I'm going to go ahead and bend it also for you. you go ahead and push the pencil key, which is your program. Now I'll go ahead and ish initialize um, cycle one. And I know that. Um, 99.5 uh, is a 90 in this material I'm working with. I'm going to go ahead and do a half, um, half inch. Do another 90. This control's got, you do 100 programs, 20 steps. So he's on sequence, or program 2, sequence 4. You do 20 steps of end program 2. And there's, again, there's 100 programs you can have. Okay, and that's a program. I'm going to go ahead and go out of the program. So you need to get out of the program mode. And now it's program 2, so I'm going to go back into that program. I'm going to go into my automatic. Program 2, I'm going to go ahead and initialize, pull it up. Now I'm going to go ahead and position it. Come into position. Show them what to bring the ram up, bud. Bring the ram up. You can adjust your ram height. Just a matter of sliding the micro switch. The top micro switch is ram position or up position. It's a cylinder. Second, second micro switch is your ram retract. Bottom one is your pressure bend. Got some auto manual mode. 
up and down on the ram position, just like a ground control, the pressure control, the pressure gauge, so I can set my tonnage. Disconnect on the machine. Ram, or this is 17512. Makes you send it in with three fingers. Bring that ram down, bud. Can you hold that? I'm going to loosen the other clamp off. I'm going to show the rotation of the tooling. Essentially one guy could do this. change uh, can you bring your ram up just jogging up I know my different V-die openings depending on what I'm bending takes one operator And good machines, we've sold a lot of them. We had a lot of happy customers. I'd like to sell you one. <laughs>